what's up, hood folks? This is Jeremy and why not Nick Rashad. Hey, what's up, hood folks? What it is? Uh, I heard you open the door. Somebody. Yeah, it was Maytag. Okay, Maytag. <laughs> but nah, it was uh, it was Amazon. Amazon. Yeah, I got you something. What? It's already open. How you gonna give me something that's already open? Because I was making sure that it was what I had ordered. Okay, open oh, Let me see what you got with your line. Yes. <laughs> Bastard. Y'all, look at this. How many of these? Like seven. I think so. You bought some? Yeah, because I know you like this the owner. And you know that the uh, Amazon, I mean, the Avon ladies around here be tripping. Y'all, what's up? That's before thank you then. You brought about saying you think about me buying me something I need or want faster. Yeah. But y'all, what's up with the Avon ladies? Every time I call Avon lady, you would think I was calling to get some cooch or something. Oh yeah, this is Jeremiah like the but <laughs> Are you a guy you wanna order Avon? Cause I, my my mama raised me up on Avon the older. I like my arm to be wet like a after birth, you know, when I get put after the order on my arm, so that's what's up. What else in that bother that in? Uh, oh, I also ordered me some um, coffee cups too. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, who drinking this much coffee? It's not about drinking that much coffee. It's just about when I'm on the go, I need something to take with me, especially my coffee. So hey, there What's, you go. What they show me? What how many you got? And how much? One hundred and fifty-six, I think. Yeah. And it come with the caps, the top stone too. I drink what two cups of coffee a week. I don't need it. <laughs> yeah, but it's these are the two colors that they gave me. Oh, uh, yeah. Rashawn sure got a shirt that he is. I bought so when I bought me some shirts. I bought him a new shirt too. Coca Cola. You look like a damn. drink responsibly. You like this? <laughs> I, let me show my little outfit off. Hold on, let me show my little outfit off. Y'all like my little shirt is short, blah, black, all black, everything. Got my little fake earrings in, bling, bling. Every time I come around, you see the bling, bling. Y'all know I be wearing them old clothes and I lost some of my weight in. They can make me like I gained all my weight back. So how do you feel about doing your first uh, photo shoot? This ain't no damn. <laughs> well, I need a whole camera crew here to get my photo shoot. It's the front. Show the back. I ain't showing the back. <laughs> anyway, so today is Monday afternoon. Yeah. We just got a <clears throat> we had a long Sunday shooting those videos, those cooking videos, and going live. So I hope y'all enjoyed those or at least check them out. So I'm finna go to the doctor. You about to go see doctor now? <laughs> no, no, no doctor now. <laughs> I want you to go on the 1200 calorie diet. Only eat lots of protein, no carbohydrates. See me in 30 days, you should lose 250 pounds. <laughs> so anyway, I'm finna go to the doctor for my head. <laughs> this head now. This head, not in them. And then that's what else we doing today. People always ask me why I'm always dancing and why I'm always saying, baby, what y'all want to be on YouTube crying? <laughs> I'm so tired of life. So tired of them. Playing dim, I'm tired of being sad. I want to kill myself. Is that what you want? Anyway, come on, let's go, man. I gotta go. Cause my doctor gonna charge me a twenty-five dollar co but late fee pay or something. Seriously? I don't know. So hood folks, I done made it out here to my doctor's appointment. <clears throat> Wanna come here with me? Rashad is like my or, or like my what does he call it when you drive your dad or granddad to the doctor? I'm driving me to my doctor's appointment. Yeah, sure for, yeah, sure. Chauffeur. No, like my grandson. You know your grandson will take your granddad to the his doctor's appointments and go get his pills and stuff. <laughs> Rashad, you my caregiver. <laughs> Come and care for me. After you just said what you said. Rashad asked me that I want to kiss him. I told him I'd rather shoot him instead. <laughs> so Going to the doctor makes people real nervous. Real, I'm nervous, I'm trembling. Only thing I hate about going to the doctor is when they check your blood. Okay, you know when you walk or exercise, well, in my way, when you walk and exercise, your you, your heart rate goes up. So when I go and get my blood pressure checked, you know, cause the time I walk in, 
They sign me in. Then, all right, we, you can come up back now, Jeremy. And we walk down this long ass hallway. I'm getting the workout in. Then they go, as soon as I sit down, they check my blood pressure. Oh my God, your blood pressure high. But then I always tell them, we'll wait till about 10 or 15 minutes after my heart rate slows down. And they check it again, and it'd be like 120 or something over 80 or 81. And I'm like, well, don't you know that you in the medical field? I'm not. You should know that checking my blood pressure, you should check my pressure after my heart calm down. Look at that man with that mess. <laughs> Leave Dale alone. Anyway, so I'm finna go in here and <laughs> get that long. <laughs> I'm finna go in. That's what I'm finna do. What you finna do while I'm here? I gotta make some calls. Yeah, hey, you the reason I'm going to see the therapist now? Why my OCD so bad? Oh yeah, I gotta make some calls. I gotta call Tyrone. Tell him to bring me some neat too while you talk to him. <laughs> Shit. Oh my god. Man, hood folks. So it's late on the evening. Later, late on the evening since we left the therapist's office. What's up, hood folks? So what we had doing is we is reheating this jerk chicken in the air fryer. Yep. Jerk it, jerk it, jerk on your ass. And then, the shop made some rice. Yeah, it made some herb and butter rice. So I wish it was the real herb, but so that's even here. here. We finna eat some of this. Yup. That's still looking good. It better taste, that was good last night, but it well, it better be good now that it's your ass. Babe, what the hell is wrong with your shirt? Man, we eating. <laughs> So, but, huh, God, this like, is this is a <laughs> this is a garden contrail from the Cosby Show. I'm Theo. Y'all, I was in the middle of or uh, making me. Uh, you know, I be taking my old shirts. I, you know, since I lost my weight, my old shirts, and I be cutting up the sleeve because I like sleeve the shirt. <laughs> but I forgot to get this on the side because I was, you forgot the whole side. But this is a garden contrail. Don't play. This shirt costs ninety six dollars. Don't play. <laughs> Y'all, this food with him good. Mm -hmm. Well, fuck, I'm telling you. I did that rice. Say I did. You eating like that? You eating it? Hey, hey, Mr. Rashad. Yes. I bake your pie. I put all the ingredients in your pie that you want. And I want you to sit down and have a piece. Oh, yes. Will you have a piece for me, Mr. I, sure will. I put that a pie. real special ingredient in it. Oh, that pie is real nice. Oh, come Ooh, on, come on. Go to the table. Would you have a piece? Cut a big piece, Mr. Rashawn. I cut a big on piece. I want you to taste the pie. Thank you, Mr. Minnie. Mr. Minnie, yeah, my name is Mr. Minnie. I'm specializing in pie. All kind of pies. Oh, man. Oh, that looks so good. It does look good. Oh man, oh man, let's try it. Mm-hmm. I put some real special in there for you. Oh. Something real special. Mm. Uh huh. Mm. Is it good? Is it delectable? Oh, very good. That's right. Mm. Eat my shit, you fucking fucker. Huh? Mm hmm. You have me go into therapy? Swallow it all. Why mm. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Uh huh. I'm the help in this motherfucker. <laughs> so, hood folk, it is Tuesday afternoon, September the 29th. The 29th? I think it is 29th. So, all last week I was in a real, real, real good mood. Because it was cool outside. Cool outside. Kind of cold. Got up to yesterday. Had to turn the air conditioning on. Ain't had air conditioning on none last week because it was feeling good. Had my box fan in the woman that win was blowing these balls like birthday candles on the cake. Had the birthday motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, I like it when it's cool too. Like cool, not too cold though. Get that pan Look at the clouds. Is that a tornado coming? <laughs> yeah, right down on you. <laughs> That's right. I'm going to pick your ass up like a Tonka truck. As long as it suck me up, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> you retarded ass. So we finna go into one of these stores, y'all. You cut me off for what I was saying. What was you saying? Go. I was talking about how 
I like it when it's cool and cold outside, and I can't wait till it snows. No, I hope it don't snow. I hope it snows. I want some good snow. I don't want snow. Yes, snow indeed. Snow may be depressed. What is your favorite time of the year? Mine's is fall, well, winter, fall. I like it cold. So, like I said, all this week, all last week, I was reconsidering, like, maybe South Carolina ain't bad after all. And then when the heat came back yesterday, I'm ready to go, even though Texas is hot as hell. But Me, my favorite is uh, fall and spring because really? it's not too hot. And then it's nice, and then you see a lot of nice bodies and stuff out on the uh, streets and little skirts and tight pants and all that. Oh, you going to put on your skirt? No, I don't do that shit. Uh, I don't know, man. <laughs> anyway... Let's go in the store. Y'all, I'm going to show y'all. I make, Look, we finna go to Walmart. I, I'm going to put on a mask, but this is going to be funny. It's here. Y'all, I'm going to show y'all my mask right here. Well, anyway, little folk, we in the store now. Rochelle, you just got your hair cut. Look at all that damn hair on your Look at that. Damn, you right. Shit. Y'all, look, I was going to put on a mask. This one, like, get on mask. But I see so many other folks. Look at that bag. <laughs> Look, at damn Look at my bag. This is how I wear my bag right here. <laughs> I need to breathe. Somebody said, why you don't like wearing a mask? I said, shit, I got a breather problem. I can't wear a mask. What got a problem? Shit, I put on a mask and I can't breathe. I have a problem. <laughs> I ain't wear this shit. I said, I might keep it on. No, I think you should take it off because you look stupid. <laughs> when you take your mess off, you look stupid with it on. Hey, I look good with it or without it. Anyway, so we is finna get some. Ooh, shit. Woo! Breathe again. Am I Tony Braxton? Nah, like I said, we finna get some little stuff. Because there's a lot of folks here without mess on, y'all. I feel comfortable now because you know you without a mess and be looking hard. I'm finna get some peaches. Peaches. Rashad, when Rashad get peaches, he turned to Rashida. Put them on to make him want to marry me. Put it on to make him want to marry me. You ain't funny. I'm juggling. Wee! Anyway, so I'm going to get my little snacks and stuff for the week. Peaches. Maybe I shouldn't touch these. They're going to bang out the Coronas. Look, look at that. Man. I want some ten apples so bad. An apple a day. Keep the doctor away. Did he mean candy apple? No. You're gonna go right to the damn dentist <laughs> eating them damn candy apples. <laughs> uh, apple <laughs> day sound like you about to go and pay for the dentist. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But these are this is one of my favorite favorite things, caramel apple. Now I don't like no the other ones like this. I don't do sprinkle. I don't like no damn sprinkle. Sprinkle me, please. I don't like pick it. Please, please, please. I'm not getting none. I'm gonna board those. Don't you want some apple cider? Hell no. Don't that make you go to the bathroom, apple cider? Maybe. <laughs> but I don't want no I think it's apple hot cider. apple cider. I don't want no apple cider. Warms in your gut. I want on apple cider I want is apple pie inside of me. Apple pie inside of me. <laughs> <laughs> so these are quick little snacks I begin sometimes. Now, I love carrots, but for a reason, this ain't good, these together. But I do like to get the, the protein stuff, the apples and the thing is in the nuts in them right here. These are the good little snack I be getting right here. And then I be trying to eat the celery. I but can't they, stand celery. Celery good for you. I be it's trying, nasty to me. I be trying to eat the celery and stuff, but if you, I think when I mix it all together it tastes better, but eating it individually is nasty. So these are snacks I like to get. Look at that. Put this for some kids. Yes. Shaped like Mickey Mouse. So these are for kids? Yes. Well, what about the grown folk? All humans matter. <laughs> <laughs> Not just young humans. Bastards. <laughs> yeah. All right, here for so. This is Rashad's favorite mercenaries, ain't it? Yep, dude. But see, I don't like the squeeze bottle. In the squeeze bottle, you can't get them corners. You shake, 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 and let it sit down. You can't get them corners. Shake, shake, shake. <laughs> Craft, Shake your boo. Craft make the worst mayonnaise. This is nasty. But this is actually good. This is like my alternative. I be showing y'all this all the time. But I be telling y'all this is the stuff I be eating to make them calories go down. But this is good. Made out of olive oil. Make a good sandwich. <laughs> neck bones. It's not neck bones. I want me some neck bones. You eat neck bones? Oh, no. You eat neck bones. You know that. But anyway, I'm going to take this olive oil. And make me some uh, ranch dressing, and it makes my ranch dressing a little healthier. Because when you make it at home, it's just a tad bit healthier because you know what you're putting in it. Can you stop moving, motherfucker? 
Man, I'm already feeling dangerous today. Ain't got no mask. Ain't wearing no mask. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. <laughs> get on out there. Everywhere you go. I'm finna get some. I'm finna get some. I'm finna get some. Can I get <laughs> Bro, what is this? Hold on. Hold for what it there? Santa B. I ain't gonna get this. Listen, a half a cup of this eggnog is 180 calories. It's 16 servings. No problem. Look at this. If I drink the whole gallon of eggnog, 2,800 calories. My egg gonna have to walk back to Texas to bring it out. <laughs> <laughs> Better get the walking there. Uh uh, I'm not finna get it. I'm gonna wait till Saturday. You think they have it by Saturday? Baby. Y'all got some willpower. Baby. I got willpower. I will power. Yes, I will buy it. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna buy it. Bro, look at all this. <laughs> look at it. No, Southern Comfort. This vanilla spice, I never had it before. I never tried this. That sounds good. But look at this shit. Yeah. You know, they doing me bad today, y'all. I ain't buying no eggnog, but this looks so good. I've been craving eggnog all week. When I mix my eggnog with me a little bit of liquor, it makes me bust quicker. <laughs> Why your face be looking like that when you be looking for something? I don't know. I guess this help you find it better. You look like that. Like... Put on your glasses. Maybe you will. <laughs> oh, I can see. I can see it clearly now. <laughs> Y'all, I want to eat. Okay, so Rashad eats cereal. I don't eat cereal. I wanted some Frosted Flakes so bad. And I went to Family Dollar and got that little store brand. Because real Frosted Flakes ain't even white no more. America is making everything white except Frosted Flakes. They turn them just as pale as they can be. Anyway, I want Frosted Flakes. They nasty. The real kind nasty. The fake kind nasty. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I have a taste for them cereals. Why don't you get the ones in this? Um, maybe they'll be good. Now, them cereal ain't going to look like this. They're going to look like little damn... How much sugar in them? 15 grams of sugar. That might sound like a lot, but that ain't a lot. There ain't going to be no sugar in no them cereal. Them no cereal going to be looking like damn fortune cookies. I'm going to I don't want that dud yet. Dud yet. So, hood folks, we back at the house. You get me? Yeah. I am in here. Just put up the little grocery stuff we buy. Bought. Get down here. And we're gonna make a bologna sandwich. I haven't had a bologna sandwich in so long. So a little bologna. Yeah, that looks like it might be good. That's a big cut. All right, and this is that Carolina pride. <laughs> the Carolina pride. You remember that time? Did we do that on the um, video when we had that Carolina pride bacon? I don't know. Where the gang of Texas? I don't know. Oh yeah, that, that I did. Yeah. Was good. Cause I said, it was unhealthy as a right. Cause I, it was that real bacon. I said, I'm not going to be disappointed eat this. Anyway, I'm putting on some of this bread right here. Nature's own multi-grain wheat bread. That's a big slice. Mm -hmm. And y'all remember when we was just at Walmart a little while ago? Well, before you get to this scene, and I was telling y'all, I bought the other mayonnaise, but this is what I got now. Like this, I hate the squeeze bottle. You like a lot of mayonnaise or little? I like a lot. We like extra mayonnaise on our sandwiches. I know, that's not the traditional black way. <laughs> I know, I know <laughs> a lot of people don't like black mayonnaise. <laughs> I'm like, what? And then, I had to give me some of the whole stay right now. I hate the first part, that pre-cum that be on the top of the Dude. mayonnaise. <laughs> we can't talk about that and we about to eat. I know hush. But I like, like I said, how do y'all like apple on the sandwich? I like mine kind of burnt like this. Yeah, like I know, right? <laughs> so, Vic, I just posted on Instagram that eggnog, y'all. That eggnog looks so good. I just posted on Instagram this right here. Come on, bologna cook. I'm gonna see how many of y'all know me. Right here, I just posted on Instagram. I 
I am sorry, y'all. <laughs> I know I'm on a lifestyle change, and I be telling y'all all the good stuff I do it by. <laughs> y'all. Did you end up getting it? It's like right there. Don't touch it. No, I did not get it. See, wheel power. When I left from back there, if you can see, every time we pull the camera out to record, everybody and their mama want to come again to see me. So I was so mad about that. But by the time we got to the front, I was just thinking about eating you know, all that we forgot to get some other stuff because I was thinking about eating you know, all. But I was so proud of myself for having wheel power. Y'all, I really want to lose 50 pounds by the end of this year. I really do. So I did not buy, I did not buy. The eggnog, and I'm proud of myself for that. So y'all should give me a thumbs up just for that. I did not oh, buy it. Yeah, right. And another reason I didn't buy it, we made all them damn tater pies Sunday, and y'all, we destroyed both of them pies. <laughs> well, we did say they was going to be gone by Wednesday. Right. That we destroyed both of them pies, so I was proud of myself for doing that. And then I'm going to stick to eating bad food only on Saturday. So I'm going to buy Mr. Eggnog Saturday. And if we go live Saturday, I'm going to drink Mr. Eggnog when he come home from work. I tell him stop at the store and get me some. And that's if we go live Saturday. So what's up, man? Here go your sandwich. How do y'all look at that? This is how I like I said. And why? Look at that damn rabbit here. Why they can't circumcise the bread? I, I, I eat it. I hate I hate this part of the bread right here. I, I I can't do that. But you eat the back part of it? No, I don't. I eat around the whole now. I don't eat that. Well I do. Mmm. Damn that good. When the last time you had a good bologna salmon? And you also, y'all remember I told y'all I was, I was, I wanted some cereal. I don't eat cereal that much. I've been craving Frosted Flakes for the past two months. I tried the good kind. I even tried this kind. These are family dollar kind. The real is trash. The store brand is trash. The dollar store kind of trash. Look at this. They ain't even white no more. They ain't even white no more. I, I really do hate to throw away this money, but because there's so many homeless, hungry people. I ain't gonna say homeless people. So many hungry people in America. But these are nails. I wouldn't insult people to get them this trash. Come on, man. Get, get, get out my face. Get out my face. So y'all, I'm finna sit here, eat my sandwich. <laughs> and I gotta go mop the floor. What you doing, washing clothes? I'm doing that now. You need to watch this cover. I'll kind of boot the juice on it. <laughs> Michelle swallowing up chips. Anyway, so somebody asked us to do reaction videos. Yeah, I've seen that too. Oh my god, look at this dude. Show him that salmon, man. That dude potato chips on salmon. That's the most annoying. Yeah. Anyway, I somebody, like the crunch. Yeah, can make me. Oh, mm -mm. Just give me my plain salmon. Come on. Somebody asked us to do reaction videos. Why we don't do reaction videos? Y'all don't have no reaction to <laughs> Much as y'all know I cut up and joke and clown, I don't have no reaction to much of nothing. If I give you reactions, this right here. When we go to the movie, we're going to the movies. I don't like going to see a certain movie with this dude. Rashad is good with reaction. We had went and saw Friday the 13th in 2009. This just off the top of my head. You would have thought Jason was in the room with us. Cool. That boy jumping in. I'm never I'm never that deep into a movie. I'm never that deep into nothing that I have a reaction to. I can't watch nobody YouTube video, no reaction be, oh, 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 oh. I have no reaction to something. So, the reason we have no reaction to stuff is I can't react. My all my all my reaction would be this right here. Or uh, this right here. <laughs> Can you sit stop all that fucking racket? What about your Me reaction? on the other hand, yes, I can't react on some things. All things. Some things. Especially movies that don't make sense to me. Yes. We were watching I some get cut I cut up. We were watching some movie the other night and what the woman was about to was finna kill her land or something. This dude acting like the movie based on a true story, like it's live happening in front of us. Get your stupid ass out the house! Get your stupid ass out the house! I'm like, dude, it's a movie, bro. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> stuff like that make me mad. So, I don't have no rations or stuff. 
And the last thing I'm gonna touch on, cause you know we like to touch on different topics while we on our vlogs, cause we don't wanna just do cutting up the whole time, is think back, not think back, think to your life right now, where you at right now. Just think, I'll forgive you a moment to think. Are you where you wanna be right now in your life? Just think. I can tell you no for me. Cause at 38, now if I go back to when I was 28, when I became 38, I was hoping that I would be doing doing radio heavy and doing music heavy and living in a in the country in a nice house. That's why I saw myself in 10 years ago today. Now I'm glad that I followed my followed through and got over a fear of moving out of Texas to come to Carolina, even though. <laughs> but no, I'm not where I want to be right now. I, I haven't got all where I want to be. Even when it comes to weight loss, that's why I'm proud of myself for not buying that damn egg and all. Even that little bit of, that little change right there, that little discipline right there, give me some strength. What about you? No. I thought today, um, you know, I thought when I was about 20, 21, 22, I thought right now I'll be a, you know, just a um, motivational speaker. Speaking to, uh, you know, Hundreds of thousands of our black brothers and sisters, but um, you know, with re events that happens and things of that nature, uh, it didn't happen for me because I didn't believe that some of our black brothers and sisters would allow me to be to listen to be listen, you know, for them to listen to me and just understand, you know, where I'm going and I in the you know the um, Sight that I have for our race as far as you know our future as a, a black people so you're living in fear I'm not living in fear oh it's just the point of that other men women and children are because they're scared to really stand out I hold myself back <clears throat> because you know I got a lot of shit to say but I hold myself back <laughs> and speaking of a lot of stuff to say you know somebody said in our video that I was holding you back Saturday I was live. holding myself back. But did, if y'all can remember, when I first got on live Saturday, I played them song. We gon' pitch a wang. Dang, do them. Uh, anyway, I clearly told y'all, I said, when Rashad left for work today, we got into an argument. If Rashad come home and I'm giving him bad vibes, so I'm not feeling him that much, it's just, that's how it is. It's not like we were purposely, well, probably was, but people try to pit us against each other and I don't like that. I be seeing a lot of y'all comments in the, in, on the video oh, when I pass to tell Rashad some, you fat Rashad, <laughs> you got a long head Rashad, then people be trying to pit us against each other, that's not gonna happen. Yeah. Right. But if I'm being real with y'all, if we being real with y'all, that offends people too, right? Mm -hmm. So keeping it real offends people, fakeness, they don't, they don't offend people, I don't think so. Mm -hmm. Especially so, taking funny vlogs. So, so, so let Rashad get in. All his thoughts out. I, I told y'all I don't eat this part of the bread. All them. Be all them. All this right here. Come on, camera. This camera on the salmon. All this right here, I can't eat. I can't eat all them. I can't eat that anyway. <clears throat> so, are you following your dreams? Come on, camera. Get on point. Are you following your dreams or are you where you want to be? That's what we're going to call this video. Yeah. Are you where you want to be? And if you're not where you want to be, you st every day you wake up out of your now I'm finna say every day you wake up out of your grave. God damn. <laughs> so they about to wake up dead. <laughs> Return of the living dead, this motherfucker. <laughs> every day you wake up <laughs> out of your bed, you got another day to make it happen. So Right. Don't matter how old you are. Right. You still got that that choice. Right. So make it. If you ain't living where you, if you're not where you wanna be, I'm not where I wanna be for it's his body. Now you got no little something. You got a big round body, that's good. It's very voluptuous. Man, you be hating so much, I swear. <laughs> I'm not hating on your body. You, you a big boy. And you still look good for a big boy. Damn, that is such an insult. That, that's an that's insult. That's not an insult. <laughs> Even though I'm not a weak person, I don't get, you know, stuff. That's insult. the only reason why I said it. Because you're not <laughs> But weak. most people, you say, that's just like saying, ooh, you're so pretty for a dark-skinned person. Or you read so well to be from the South. That's not a compliment. Those insults. <laughs> 
but dark skinned folks are sexy. No, you know some people tell a woman, damn, she's so pretty to be dark skinned. Yeah, like, like what like if she was like, not what if dark skinned? Skin oh, what the hell that supposed to mean? I hate when people say stupid stuff like that. Because they say dark skinned folks are ugly, I guess. I don't think so. I don't what, think so. I love dark skinned folks. That's why I want my I want this is why I want my kids to be this color right here. Oh God! But come in, little blacky. Black like a TV. Come in, little blacky. You nice. Black like a cut off TV. <laughs> <laughs> come in, little sexy. Now, now that sounds weird. They even call me the sexy. Come in, boy. You, I'm gonna give them all that confidence. So you be proud of your black skin. So we just babbling on. And we coming to the end. We have come to the end of the vlog. Yes. Hope sir, you have folks. enjoyed it. Shout out to all our people that watch our videos, that like our videos, that comment and stuff. Shout out to the people that hit us up and tell us, Jeremy. Y'all videos help us out because we do get a, quite a bit email from people that say our videos help them out yeah. and they be feeling depressed, down and out, and these videos helps them out. So that's why we do it for the laugh. Anyway, hood folks, thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and press that ugly ass bell button to get notified whenever we put up new content on our page. And also, you can follow us on Instagram. What's your Instagram? Bob Barker, Price is Right, underscore 55. Come on down. <laughs> anyway, mine is the big underscore boss man on Instagram. The big, the big, not T, T H E, big underscore boss man. Okay. And what's yours? Jeremy is grown. I always remember that. So anyway, it's it's about four in the evening. I'm finna go and get my chores get together because I'm watching the debate. Even though I'm not stunning my bow, I still want to see the debate. Are y'all watching the debate or did y'all watch the debate by the time y'all get to the video? Anyway, I hood folks. Peace. Peace to the Middle East. Where the Middle East at? Africa. No. The Middle East isn't Africa. I have partial. <laughs> Don't, do partial in Africa. Don't do it. Don't do it. Partial don't in do Africa. It. Don't do me. Do your hair. My hair got. I just got my hair cut. What you talking about? <laughs>